you find some of the best Sri Lankan food in all of Los Angeles? Well, today on Eat Live Love San Fernando Valley, we're going to learn what Sri Lankan food is all about as we're at Curry Pinch in Tarzana. The San Fernando Valley has a lot to offer. Amazing food, rich history, tons of community events, and amazing people and organizations. I'm Scott Himmelstein with the Scott Himmelstein Group, and this is Eat Live Love San Fernando Valley. Jeff Shaheen, awesome to be here. Thank you. Well, congratulations on your new place here in Tarzana, moving from Van Nuys. So most people have never tried Sri Lankan food. They don't know anything about it. So if somebody's coming here to Curry Pinch, what should they expect? Sri Lankan food, um, we have influenced by many uh, Asian countries. So we have combined and have unique uh, flavor when it comes to Sri Lankan cuisine. So we have like a staple of Sri Lanka is like rice and curry, like uh, vegetables, rice, many variety of vegetables that comes with a plate. And also we have uh, like a Chinese uh, Sri Lankan fried rice. Uh, and then South Indian like a, a coconut roti. Those are all influenced by, uh, and we have made it a little bit different than the origin. All right, so you, you just talked about one of them, coconut roti, mm -hmm. what is that? The coconut roti is like very simple flat bread. It's a mixture of uh, uh, flour and uh, shredded coconut. So that can be eaten with any kind of vegetables or a meat curry, uh, lot, many sides. And typically, what does your curry come with or look like? Because it's not the typical Indian curry or curry that you might find when you, you go to Holland, which is very well known for their different spices from around the world. So our curry is a little bit more towards like a, a dry version. When we make curry, when it comes to vegetables, we, we don't like put all kind of spices into it. So you will see like when you make a beetroot curry, it's like red and the lentil curry yellow and the kale salad green. So we have colors uh, of vegetables, you know, when you see, okay, it's a rainbow colors. All right, so what are you gonna have me try today? So. I would say the chicken biryani because the chicken biryani, what we make here is a little bit different. What unique about our biryani is everything, all the, the ingredients mixed and I have created my own way. So I want you to try our chicken biryani. Well, I'm thrilled to be able to try it and I'm super hungry. Let's go back in the kitchen and see Let's how you do it. Let's go, all right, thank you. <laughs> Guys, all of this food looks great, very colorful. Let's dive into it. So I'm gonna start off with the coconut roti. And the best way I can describe it, just by looking at it, it has a different texture than maybe the naan, the Indian type of bread that you might be more familiar with. So let's try uh, breaking off a piece, dipping it in the, the curry sauce, maybe putting some caramelized onions on it and put in uh, some of the curry chicken. The first thing you experience, besides the bread itself, the coconut roti, is the curry chicken. And then after a bite of the curry chicken, you can, you can taste the flavor from the bread. This is a really good dish. I mean, this is probably, you could probably have it as a meal, but at the very least, this is a great appetizer to share with friends and family. All right, now for the chicken biryani. So I'm really excited to try this. I've had chicken biryani from different parts of the world. So I'm really curious to try the Sri Lankan version of it. Let's dive right into it. Maybe pour a little bit of the yogurt sauce on it. And then you got the garlic chili. Mix it up, get a little bit of everything. Get some of the rice. Want to get some of the, obviously the chicken itself. Mm -hmm. 
Guys, this has an incredible flavor profile and just all the ingredients together uh, find a way to co-mingle. So you got the basmati rice, you got the caramelized onion, obviously you got the curried chicken, and then you throw in the yogurt sauce and the garlic chili powder and just all of it together. Of course, you have the fried egg on top and it just makes for a wonderful dish. I highly recommend these guys. So Curry Pinch, these guys are located in Tarzana on Ventura Boulevard in between Tampa and Wilbur. Highly recommend them. If you're looking for Sri Lankan food to be able to try something a little bit different, there are not a lot of Sri Lankan restaurants around and we're fortunate enough to have a, one of the top rated Sri Lankan restaurants in all of Los Angeles. So highly recommend you come out and check these guys out. If you like this episode, make sure you like, comment, and share so we can help promote these guys. And we look forward to seeing you next time on Eat, Live, Love, San Fernando Valley.